And as she just mentioned, the threat of winter weather has the city of Memphis and MLGW on high alert tonight with plans ramping up in recent days, even in recent hours. ABC 24 Zaria Oates continues our team coverage live downtown where officials with both MLGW and the city just held a news conference. So Zaria, uh, what was the major takeaway tonight? <laughs> Richard, those big takeaways, one of them being that now is the time to prepare, not the time to panic. It's extremely cold. That is the understatement of the year. It's very windy, but MLGW and the city's public works division want everyone to know that now is also the time to stock up on food, stock up on water, make sure you have enough, and then also to stay off those roads if you can as much as you can once that winter precipitation begins. Now, MLGW President Doug McGowan did say that he does not not believe that there will be a need for another set of rolling blackouts as the TVA ordered during the last Arctic blast in December of 2022. McGowan said there still could be an energy conservation alert. This is a voluntary option to cut back how much electricity you're using to prevent any issues from a higher electricity demand during the cold days ahead. We expect that uh, despite the increased demand for home heating and business heating that we're going to be able to meet everybody's demand. We'd ask that you start dripping water from all of your faucets inside the house. Outside the house, today is a really good day to stop by your hardware store and make sure you have a protection for that outside spigot so that the outside spigot doesn't freeze. President McGowan isn't expecting a possible energy conservation alert until maybe Tuesday. And again, that's still a possibility, but just so you're aware of that. And then tomorrow on Saturday morning, the city's public works division will begin salting those roads so that they're as easy or as manageable to drive on as possible. And the city will give another update on Monday. Live in downtown Memphis, I'm Zaria Oates.